Mark Bromley at home in the FA Trophy. What's your thoughts ahead of the game? Yeah, I think um, us as a staff, we're always energised by working with a group throughout the week. We're always excited before a game. So um, a cup game always probably has a little bit of a different feel to it. And um, really looking for the boys to take the shackles off a little bit and really try and put their best foot forward. It's going to be a really, really tough game. I mean, Bromley riding high and rightly so in, in, in the league. Um, we had a really good game against them at our place. Um, but... Yeah, we've worked, we've worked hard in training as we always do and um, trying to find solutions to come up with ways to, to win the game and uh, we're going to be trying to ask a lot of questions of them and, and make sure that we, um, we're tough at the back and we, we defend and we're organised and we keep building on, on all the positive momentum that we're, we're having at the moment but still looking for them, uh, those, those marginal gains all the time to try and show, show improvement. You touched on solutions to win the game there. Obviously, in the last round, Kingstonian, we were 1-0 down in the first half and the second half come out and, you know, we worked hard to get the winner and, you know, probably deserve the win in the end. Yeah, I think so. And it was a really tough game, a different type of game. I think Maidenhead, you know, it, we keep having different challenges, different games thrown at us. So this is great for our own learning and, and also how we adapt and, and learn to find those solutions during the game. And um, I've been really pleased by the way we end all games at the moment. I think we're really showing... Uh, how fit and strong we are. We're getting, we're, we're getting fitter and stronger all the time and I feel we really always finish games strongly and it, I think that's a lot to show with, with the character as well and, and the team spirit that we're, we're building here. So we've got plenty to build on, plenty to be pleased about, but we've, we've got to keep wanting more. Um, you know, we've got to keep wanting to improve and get better. Of course, with the form in the league, I'm beating, oh, well, one loss in nine. You'll take that into confidence going into the FA Trophy game this weekend as well? Yeah, I think, you know, you can see the boys are confident you can see the boys you know setbacks in games now don't don't you know kick us off track at all we, you know we we know that we we always end up games strong and we can but sometimes you know you've got to throw a few jabs you've got to you've got to take um you know get to grips with the opposition get to grips with the game and um i think we we've started to do that better but look one one area of improvement we want to have um you know earn more territory in the first half, ask more questions because, you know, second half, we can't always wait. You know, we've got to make sure that we, uh, you know, get out of the traps flying. Of course, looking at Bromley, obviously you faced them early on in your managerial career here. What are you expecting from them? I think they've got a fantastic array of players. Um, you know, they can hurt you in a range of ways. So, you know, we've got to be you know, right, right at it. Um, like I said, they've got real experience in the team. They've got great athleticism as well, and, and some real, real good technicians. So yeah, they, they're gonna they're gonna test us in a range of ways. We've got to be our absolute best. I say that every week, but you know, even more so against when when teams like Bromley come come to town. But they're they're coming to our place, um, and we've got to make sure it's a really tough afternoon for them. Of course, a relatively new player we know well as well, Scott Wagstaff as well. But I believe he's cup tied for the game, so. Maybe won't be involved this weekend. Yeah, fortunately he's cup tied, but um, I'm sure he'll be um, trying to share some some help uh, with, with with their manager. I think you know Bromley have obviously shown um, their intent by acquiring a player of, of, of Scott's uh, talent. Um, so look, it shows where, where where they are and and the business that they're doing. So yeah, it's going to be it's going to be a tough game. You know, I'm sure Scott will try and help him out the best best he can, but uh, fortunately he's not on the pitch. Of course, we obviously have a few players cup tied for our team as well, but it's an opportunity for players to come in and show what they can do in the FA Trophy once again. Always, every game is always another opportunity, and uh, we're starting to see a few faces pick up uh, more training minutes. So you know, we might have another one back on the on the bench, which will be great. So we're starting to claw back some of those players, um, the ones which were on the bench earlier than expected on Saturday. have had another week's training under their belt, so hopefully we're making some strides forward. You never get carried away in this game, especially. Uh, you know the way it's gone so far with the injuries but we're doing everything we can to deliver them safely uh, and build their fitness up and uh, yeah here comes another game where we can look, continue to build on that um, maybe get some more minutes into players um, but also just keep refining keep working hard keep just trying to improve you know it never, it never changes I know I bore you every week Henry was saying sometimes the same things but whatever, whatever game it is whoever we take on we, 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 we prepare to win the game the best we can we show respect to the opposition by doing our research and our homework um, but you know we got to just continue to keep growing as a group of course I can't ask you are in the middle of January transfers bouncy flying left right centre what's the latest on those Fully focused on what's in-house, on what we got. Um, like I said, the, new, the, the players who have been injured coming back are like new signings. Like we haven't just missed them for a week or two. They've been cruelly missing for a, for a while now, so that they feel like new signings. We're always looking to improve any which way. 
Um, if so, we felt someone would, would improve us and add value, then we would certainly do that. We have a, a strict way of, of working here on, on, on who we recruit, how we recruit. Um, but like I said, I'm really, I'm really pleased with the, with the group that we got at the moment. And as always, it's always been full focus on them and preparing for what is a, a huge game with one of the biggest carrots in football you could ever have uh, with Wembley at the end of it. How much of a, of a goal is that for you, obviously, guiding all the shot to a you know, Wembley final? Well, it's massive. You know, we can't take our eye off the ball, but the the, the prize is is huge. And uh, you know, forgive me, I'm not sure how many games is it. Is it four or uh, you know, it might be. It's not. You know, how often can you say you're that many games away from Wembley? So, uh, you know, we, we're certainly not looking ahead. This is why I don't know how many games there is. But what we are looking at is a, a really tough Bromley side um, in front of us. But one, if we can really perform at our absolute best, we've got a chance of, of progressing. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information. Click here for the next video. Click here to subscribe.